Tilly Bob. How you doing, my brother? Give thanks, King. Thanks for having me on your platform. It's a great honor being here as well. He's a humble guy now. But how old are you, Tilly Bob? If you, if, if you don't mind share. If you don't mind share. Well, um, I don't I don't really want to share that at this time. All right, that's all right. You that's know. fine. Yeah. But but you're a young general now, a, a, a boss out in the business. And uh, the songs them where you are singing right now is really healing to the nation because you're singing some songs that really uplift anything we are going negative right now. Why is that so, Give brother? Thanks. Why is that so? Well, I feel like it's the time for it, really. I feel like um, at this time, we have to be the change that we want to see and i'm a person who fully subscribe to that so you know i normally if i subscribe to something i like to embody it so if i want to be the change that i want to see i have to represent you know and i feel like the youths them of this time really need that message they need that balance because it's not as it was before true that they are we are we are influenced by uh just by the growth of technology within itself. So there are more outlet, there's more information, there's more things that we will be privy to in this day and age that we wasn't, you know, privy to at the time. Mm-hmm. Of, 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 for example, like when Bob and them was around, you know. Yeah, but there's so much directions to go with the music. You could have got some girl broke out, skin out, waggers are well, we I could have got some gun thing and some ray ray, but you choose to go cultural, conscious, uplifting. Because when me hear a song, them, you know, it's especially Psalms. The first time me hear Psalms, I say, whether you are a pre man or whether in a female, make him go on a Psalms. Italy, or you just <laughs> Psalms it all for them, so brother. <laughs> you know that I'm um, up to, let me see, uh, just over the over the past strong, um, a lot of people been calling me and talking about that particular song Psalm mm-hmm. um, they're complimenting me like that is the greatest reggae song ever written not even just reggae song the song itself and you know that song is something that is a song that I challenge myself even the people that I work mm-hmm. with on the album yeah. um, mm-hmm. um, that most of them Psalm is their favorite song um, Psalm came to me so easy wow. um, I was actually at my a friend's Studio, and I just sing the melody, which was the chorus. And the, 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 my brethren look at me and him say, "Is that you know, hit that you know, build upon it you know?" And when he said it, I knew it. When I sung it, it yeah. it's so it's so um, it's so raw and so true that mm-hmm. when I when when I sing the melody, um, I just left. I left. I left there right away, and I was driving home because I'm like, Yo, I'm gonna write this song. Mm-hmm. So I left this. I left. I left yeah. this house, and I was driving home. Yeah. And I'm like, and I like, I said to myself, I said, you know what? You have to challenge yourself with this song in terms of. Uh, it would be crazy if you could do a song about bandaid. Because I remember I, I had a cut on my finger. Yeah. And I was looking at my finger at the light. Yeah. And and I had the bandaid on it, and I and I said to myself, it would be nice if you could. Uh, create a song using bandaid mm-hmm. and and then while I was driving off I'm like but you can't just say bandaid you have to be clever with it yeah so that's why if you listen to the song if I didn't tell you you wouldn't even know no when I said um cabinet I run for aid mm-hmm. I talk about bandits yeah tell them to stop the madness them can't match up the oneness that's where it all started wow just the bandaid mm-hmm. you understand yeah. cabinet I run for aid yeah, I want to forget it. It's bandied in about that. Yeah, man, it, no, I, 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 I'm okay. more than get okay. it, man. Okay. I'm more than, okay. I'm more than yeah. I'm just so thinking while just... you're talking, you know. I say, I say, wow, you know. Yeah, so yeah. now, yeah. while I get that now, I just start building on it. Okay. You know, and and the production. And at the time, at the time, um, I was recording my album, I Am Reggae, which will be dropped early, early early first quarter of next year. Yeah, I remember, uh, I remember you told me er, in the middle of the year, say so they work on your album. So it's finally finished now. Yeah, it's finished and everything. I'm just waiting on the vinyls. Once I get the vinyls, I'm going to drop everything. Um, yeah, but that's that's how that song came about. And um, I'm happy for all the... Tell you, me, me love, let me tell you something. Me love Psalms. And, and quick before we go, because this name quick and fast, you, know, you have another yeah, song man. come out right now named mm-hmm. Promise Myself. You know, you know right. a lot of people need to promise themselves when they're going to do things in their life. And you promise yourself, say, you must make it one day. You yes, must sir. make it. 
how that come about to because you promise yourself so you know so you, you have to make you have to um, fulfill your promise you know yes yes definitely so it's um well the album i am reggae it's the, it, the body of work and it that was one a part of it because of the struggle of the struggle of true talent of true geniuses of true artists out there it doesn't have to be music whatever your field you know in, in life is i feel like we all have our own struggle and our own burden to bear and we have to make a, a promise to ourselves, one that we have to keep and not break, you know, to, to achieve that goal, whatever wow. it is that we set for ourselves. Wow. Wow. So, you know, just 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 just, just making it in life mm -hmm. is, is one of those things for me, you know, um, to look at myself in the mirror. I know that I applied myself and I did it. It is it, something that everyone should be proud of, you know. You am read about your Tillibop. You step up and you're humble with it. You know, every time I call you, answer okay. the phone, I send you a message, you send me back a message. But I love you keep that, brother, because, you know, it's very important to we as radio jacks and as, as presenter on the radio, and we play your songs, them, and we can reach out to the artists and give them a one-on-one. -on -one. From day one, I remember me in a chat group, and you reach out to me from early last year, from them time, the man, you click, brother, and me I follow the career, and me appreciate the music that I put in at this time, because we need the music there. So just keep up the good work, and we have much more for do for you. You don't know. Give thanks, King. I appreciate love the support. Thank you for supporting my career as well. Any final word to the fans them out there? Tillibop fans them. Yes. Uh, to all my fans, I love you very much. Keep the positivity going. You know, know thyself is the most important thing. And um, I am ready to be dropping first first quarter. So be on the lookout for that. Not what love, you know, and life. All right, my brother. Big up yourself. And you know me, touch base with you. Zane, thanks for taking the time Give out. Give thanks, King. Big up yourself. No problem. That's the fun. That was Tillibab, a young general. People, I said, check him out. Check him out. Them songs, them. Whoa, we need them songs. <laughs>